Hey, so there is a a uh, Petra's Run cheese that I actually discovered um, with the the help of Froggy and Cheese Forever. I will link the the videos I used of theirs in the description. But um, this is a, a Queen's Walk only Petra's Run cheese using the Salva Salvation's Grip uh, wall breach. You can uh, launch into Queen's Walk. And uh, make sure you're lagging when you do it, and you can actually delay the spawning of uh, all the doors that lead to the the vault area into the halls of two souls. And uh, you just wall breach the door with salvations like that. Preferably, you play warlock so you get uh, ick dash. And uh, you see respawning restricted. You need to get past the first door before that for that shows up. And uh, second door doesn't really spawn in. The vault door doesn't spawn in. And then the covering over the, the hole in the back of the room also does not spawn in. But the way that this works is um, you glitch to the first door. You load into the Hall of Two Souls. And that loads the, the first vault area. Not the one that's used in Queen's Walk, but the first one. Like the normal vault. And uh, once you get into the chest room, your friends can join you, and you can um, turn off your, your download or whatever you're doing to make yourself lag. So, you know, your 6 trillion Twitch streams they have open, your, your 4 games are downloading, you know, turn all that off. Wait for your friends to join you. So, once your friends have joined you, they're going to load up in the Hall of Two Souls behind uh, the doors uh, you need to breach those using salvation's grip to, to get back to the actual queen's walk area uh, later on I show myself actually doing that because my friend didn't know how to do the breach but um you, you're just gonna run all the way back to Morgeth and uh, you're gonna need your super as, as warlock to do it it's probably you probably only want to do this as warlock just because you need salvation's grip ammo. Titan, you can sword fly over this jumping puzzle, but you're gonna lose all your salvation's ammo. So I'd say probably just only try this in warlock and don't rip your hair out. But yeah, if you put on double grenade launcher uh, reserves, you get 20 shots for salvation's. So you can if if you get it down consistently, you can hit most of the doors first try, and you have more than enough ammo to do it. But uh, once you get back here, you can just wait for your super to come back. And uh, you're just going to fly over the jumping puzzle area using the uh, Dawnblade. And uh, once once you cross the entire gap, you are just going to, uh, to run all the way back to the Shirochi area. And there's a giant ass staircase that you have to climb up, but... At the very top is the door, so just climb all the way up there. So you just breach through this wall again. And you keep running all the way back across the bridge. You climb up on some of the rocks and you go all the way back across the bridge to uh, Cali. And once you get back to the the Cali door, you just wall breach this one. Um, I got halfway stuck to the door for some reason. Meleeing pushed me through. I was not able to recreate that, but uh, shoot shoot the salvation shots a little bit closer to the door than what I did. Uh, that'll stop you from getting stuck in it most of the time, at least. But you just climb all the way back up here, and you need to reload 
the uh, the area where Cali is. And the the reason you need to reload it is because the um the wish wall for whatever reason isn't active unless you load the area again. You can like put in wishes, but they just don't count. They don't work. Um. At least in my testing, that's how it worked. So it, but I've never had it fail to uh to activate when you reload the area. And then Froggy says something similar in his video too. But you just you just reload the area and then you go up to the uh, the wish wall and you put in the uh, the wish for Petra's run. So I just jump cut, but pause the video there if you need to see the actual wish. But, uh, yep, wish is put in. Hopefully your friend has not left the game or done anything, but if you're only with one other person, you just promote them to leader, you go to orbit, and then you rejoin them. So once you load back in, you're going to go to this door in the back of the area, the one on the other side from the vault, next to the, the giant crystal. And you are just going to breach to this door. And then you just run straight forward to the second door. And you just breach to that one as well. And now you are back in the Queen's Walk area. So what you do is you jump into Riven's mouth. You load the uh, the heart section, which will activate adjoining allies. And it will also give you Fates Chosen, so you will actually be able to pick up the heart. So you can actually get even cheesier. Uh, instead of going to the right side when you breach the wall, you can have one person, except for the person that is putting in the wish, but anybody else can, they can go over to the left side uh, after they go through this first door. So yeah, they run to the left side, and they just run all the way to the, uh, the vault area, and all the way around into the chest room, they just fall down the hole, go into the chest room. And uh, they can dunk the heart ahead of time, because the game actually does not care if you have the heart. You can you can just dunk it anyways. And what this does is it basically automatically completes Queen's Walk, so as soon as the first person gets teleported into the heart, it automatically completes it for everybody, and therefore completes Petra's run, so that's a big plus. Uh, this person can either leave the fire team and rejoin, or they can just stay down here and wait to get hit with the joining allies. It honestly doesn't matter, as long as, uh, as, long as they're not fate chosen, it really doesn't matter. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, anyways, here's a clip of me and my friends actually completing uh, Petra's Run Queen's Walk only with four people. So, uh, yeah. Um, that's pretty much all there is. This is a pretty insane cheese, and I hope you guys enjoy it. So, yeah, you guys have fun. See, yeah. pick it up. Does it after I get teleported, right? Yeah. Oh, well. Wait, what? Alright, let's keep this. Let's just go. I have a way to do it. Come on. Three. It did immediately two, teleport us. One. I'm in the heart now. I'm out of the heart. Petra's when I got it. <laughs> there. I yeah. don't even have to. You, you don't have to open the fucking chest. You guys are done. Oh my god. Okay, well, bro. that was the easiest fucking cheese. And I don't even have creeping darkness or anything. Oh, there, there's, there's your Petra's run.